WWE has always been in a place which maintains high standards in their appearance of their top performers. This is mainly because WWE Chairman Vince McMahon is famously known for being a body guy, meaning that he has the mindset that a main event WWE talent should look a certain way. This has been seen throughout WWE history with pushes of the likes of Hulk Hogan, Lex Luger, John Cena, Batista and even Roman Reigns. Despite these established standards, life on the road makes it hard to maintain the perfect body, meaning the only time wrestlers have to focus on their diet and get in true peak shape is in their downtime which is extremely limited or when they get extended time off due to an injury or unspecified reasons. But with that being said, here are 10 WWE superstars who returned with a new body. Be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell for daily wrestling videos. Number 1 Edge now, nobody expected Edge to come out of retirement following his unfortunate retirement in 2011. Therefore, when Edge returned during the 2020 Men's Royal Rumble, he received one of the biggest ovations of all time as fans were delighted to see one of the best of all time back in the ring. Edge revealed that when he was cleared by doctors in 2019, he reached out to Rey Mysterio to ask for advice in relation to how he got in such good shape as they are both of similar ages. Mysterio recommended a nutrition company that provided healthy meals. Edge revealed he stuck to this new diet that Mysterio suggested religiously and then combined the new diet with a strict exercise program. He admitted in the past that he tried to combine exercise with a poor diet but it never worked. But now he combines a good diet with religious exercise and that's how he got in the best shape of his life at 46 years old. Number 2 Jinder Mahal the push of Jinder Mahal in 2017 is one of the more controversial WWE pushes in recent memory. Jinder, who had previously been a complete jobber, was suddenly thrown into the main event scene on SmackDown and won the WWE Championship from Randy Orton in his first ever WWE title match at Backlash 2017. The logic behind the push and the WWE title win was because WWE was planning on expanding their position in the Indian market and was looking for Jinder to be the face of the marketing campaign. Despite this reason making business sense, fans believed it was due to Jinder's body transformation. When he returned in 2016, he was notably bigger than in his previous run, not to mention veins were even popping out. This size and mass just seemed to increase as we went into 2017 and Jinder got in the best shape of his WWE career. Jinder would reveal that the change was because he wasn't happy with his body and that his new diet consisted of no alcohol and no cheat meals with an emphasis on consistency. In terms of working out, Jinder himself stated that he works out 6 days a week for 2 hours a day without fail. Number 3 The Big Show Naturally, being 500 pounds and 7 feet tall makes it extremely hard to stay in shape and WWE legend The Big Show has struggled with his appearance in the past. Big Show's weight was a true demon for him during his early days in WWE, so much so that in 2000 he was sent to OVW to lose weight and have his attitude adjusted as he was adamantly on a dangerous path of not caring about his body. His weight would then fluctuate throughout the years before his return to WWE television in 2017 and he would shock WWE fans with a new body. Big Show would lose over 70 pounds and would begin to train every single day with a mixture between weight and cardio. Big Show stated the reason for the change was because John Cena made a passive joke regarding how a giant with abs wouldn't be marketable. So Big Show set out to prove him wrong and he certainly did. Big Show did reveal that Cena did reach out to congratulate Show on his success of achieving his body goals and Show stated that this was a huge boost to his confidence and mentality. Big Show would also reveal that his weight loss was also the goal of having a match with Shaq and he wanted to be in better shape. But unfortunately, that match never happened. Number 4 Mick Foley the hardcore legend Mick Foley was never known for his physical appearance, meaning he had to rely on his natural charisma and storytelling abilities to ascend to the top of the WWE, which he did as he won the WWE title on more than one occasion. Nevertheless, the constant punishment Foley would stood during his wrestling career, which included being thrown off the Hell in a Cell structure, meant that he found it difficult to exercise and in 2015 he weighed over 300 pounds. Foley realized he needed to make a change and made major dietary changes. Along the dietary change, Foley asked former WCW champion Damon Dallas Page to help him out using his popular weight loss program DDP Yoga. 
Foley's weight loss was seen during his appearance at WrestleMania 32, where he had lost over 30 pounds and looked in the best shape of his life. The change in mentality and appearance also led him to getting the role as Raw GM in 2016, and by the time December of that year came around, he had lost over 100 pounds. Number 5. The Rock The Rock is one of the most popular stars in the world. Whilst always having a great look during his initial WWE run between 1996 and 2004, he wouldn't really change his physique until his second WWE run in 2011. In 2011, fans noticed that The Rock appeared much larger during the promotion for the release of Fast Five, which was arguably his breakout role. Suddenly, The Rock turned into a fitness king and his fitness regimes and personal pictures of him in the gym would be hot topics on social media. The Rock revealed that he starts his workout at 3.30am and consumes over 6,000 calories per day, which is absolutely insane. When The Rock returned to the WWE in 2011, he looked completely transformed and was one of the biggest men on the roster. Despite looking bigger, The Rock's quickness wasn't all there during his matches with John Cena and CM Punk. Despite that, The Rock's body transformations had wider motivations in relation to his Hollywood success as he was able to secure more serious roles and be taken seriously as an action star, as can be seen in such movies as the Fast and Furious franchise and San Andreas. Number 6. Drew McIntyre Drew McIntyre's first WWE run started out well with him being labelled as the chosen one by Vince McMahon. However, his star soon faded and he would later be released after being mainly used as enhancement talent during the later stages of that initial run. He would return to WWE in 2017 after a very successful stint in other companies which included a run as TNA World Champion. McIntyre would return to the NXT brand and would look like a completely different person. He was in the best shape of his life and looked like a legit superstar. Vince McMahon was clearly impressed by this transformation as McIntyre was quickly called back up the main roster and is currently undertaking an incredible successful run as WWE Champion. McIntyre would admit that he never took his fitness and his body too seriously during his initial WWE run, and when he was released, it was the wake-up call he needed. McIntyre now puts as much effort into his body as he does to the other aspects of his life. McIntyre's body transformation was so impressive that it was featured in a notable fitness publication, Men's Health. Number 7. Rey Mysterio Due to Rey Mysterio's size, many expected him never to reach the top of the WWE upon signing for the company in 2002. Despite this, he managed to get himself over with his fantastic moveset and match quality, which led him to being a multi-time world champion and one of WWE's most popular merchandise sellers of all time. Mysterio would leave the WWE in 2014 to explore other ventures before making a return in 2018 during the Men's Royal Rumble match. The first thing fans noted that was Mysterio looked completely different. He was completely shredded with toned abs, arms and a body that literally transformed the former WWE Champion into someone fans had never seen before. Mysterio at the age of 45 has managed to get into the best shape of his life whilst maintaining a full-time WWE contract and while still maintaining the same level of wrestling that made him popular to begin with. That is incredibly impressive. Number 8. Braun Strowman Braun Strowman's body change may not appear to be that major on the surface, however if you watch him during his first few months in the WWE, he was a lot heavier and slower as a result. Once Braun split away from the Wyatt family during the 2016 brand split, he was positioned as one of the top guys on Raw and as a result, he drastically changed his image. Over the next few months, as Braun's position in the company grew and he was getting wider opportunities, he would seemingly get more leaner with each and every passing week. Braun would update fans on his Instagram during his process and would even show off pictures of him having abs for the first time in his life. As Braun lost weight, his in-ring work rate also increased as he became a lot quicker in the ring and began to do kick-ups, which is a drastic change because he was rather slow and clumsy when he initially debuted in 2015. Number 9. Sheamus Sheamus is one of the most decorated superstars in WWE history, attaining a list of accolades that includes multiple world titles, a Royal Rumble win and even a King of the Ring victory. Sheamus has certainly been a workhorse for the WWE for the past decade. Sheamus' body transformation came about in 2017 and the reason for his drastic change was that Vince McMahon made a passing joke towards Sheamus backstage regarding his weight gain with the line, Enjoyed the holidays, huh? whilst looking at his stomach. Sheamus reacted to this comedic dig from the WWE chairman by losing over 40 pounds and becoming one of the WWE's most ripped superstars. 
Seamus managed to get in the best shape of his career and managed to turn his newfound passion and love for fitness into a side hobby with the creation of his YouTube series, The Celtic Warrior Workouts, which Seamus works out with fellow WWE superstars such as John Cena, Jinder Mahal, Seth Rollins, and Becky Lynch. And number 10, Triple H. Triple H's physique has fluctuated a lot during his WWE career. After his quad tear in 2001, he seemingly started to gain a lot of weight and he was at his heaviest during 2003 due to the major injuries that impacted how he trained. Despite this, this didn't change his in-ring work and he was still able to put on several notable classic matches during this time period. At one stage, WWE even released a Triple H based fitness book, Making the Game, which was released in 2004. However, after his semi-retirement from wrestling in 2010, Triple H started a new diet program alongside a new fitness regime which involved working out at midnight alongside his wife Stephanie. At one stage, Triple H revealed that he had lost 15 pounds in 15 days, leading to his WrestleMania 31 match against Sting. Despite fans not getting to see Triple H wrestle more than once a year these days, when he does wrestle, fans are completely blown away by the condition his body's in, especially when you take into account how busy he must be in his executive role and his long history of established injuries. But there you have it guys, 10 WWE wrestlers who returned with a new body. Be sure to comment down below, subscribe if you haven't already, follow us on Instagram and Twitter, and I'll see you next time with some more wrestling content.